Hello ladies, my name is Kate and welcome to my channel. I did have two unboxings today, but they turned into being two reveals. When I was doing the unboxing, I called the bags by the wrong names. I did something or whatever and anyway, I wound up messing up the video. So this is a retake. Take two. <laughs> Alright, well my first reveal is that I purchased a bag from eBay. Um on eBay, it looked, I mean, I know it was used, um, you know, it looked like it needed a lot of love and attention, but I got it for a pretty good price. Okay, first reveal. I bought a, this is supposed to be a mini satchel, but I compared it to my pink one back there, and I think it's a small satchel. I've got it in the white. I'm going to have to put, um hair ties on these because they're really wonky looking. I looked all over the whole bag and I didn't see any scratches or digs or marks or anything on this bag. Handles are nice and soft and broken because it's a used bag. However, inside, which you're not going to probably be able to see, it was really dirty on the bottom. I had some silver paper, like gum paper down there. Um, the pockets have lined lint in them, so I'm going to have to, like, clean that out. But I didn't see any stains. And it does have the leather key keeper with the gold, shiny gold hardware. So that's a bonus. But inside, there's no stains, but I do need to clean it. Like I said, there's... Down the pockets, there's all lint and stuff for the pockets, so. But there's no marks or anything on this, and I bought this for $137, which, uh, you know, the small satchels go for about, I think it's a 168, I mean, excuse me, 368 brand new. So, I'm trying to get this one right, so I don't mess this up now. So, I thought I'd, I did a pretty good deal. I'm going to clean her up. I'm going to wrap these up, you know. And I, oh, I wanted the white bag. <clears throat> Excuse me, still getting over that cold. I wanted the white bag, so I think this will do. And she's really soft, really broken. So anyway, so I got the uh, small satchel in white for $137 from eBay. Okay, moving on now to my big, um, I wanted to have a big unboxing for this one, but it turns out to be a reveal. When I unboxed this, for some reason I was calling it a Chelsea Shopper. It's the Chevron Leisure Shopper. The same one that Charlotte's Bags has. It's in the brown and the chestnut. The brown tomorrow trim. Has feet. The stitching is in my kind of a yellow. Looks really nice. I really like these. I really like the handles here too. Plenty of room inside to put. Yes, even the kitchen sink it looks like. It has all the standard pockets. And there's a the snap pocket, which Junior could do away with, but they haven't yet. On some bags, they have. This bag is big. I think the base here is supposed to be like 14 inches, but the way it's built, it's it's more in the top. I think it's around 17 inches from the top, something like that. I haven't measured it. There's a Dooney plate, the emblem right there. It's beautiful. This coated cotton feels really nice. Feels like these high-end bags, but not like I would really know because I don't have any. <laughs> Has that nice um, trim here in the leather. So I got this for $138 on I Love Dooney. It's originally $198. So I'm quite happy with this. I'm going to uh, stuff this and see what all I can fit in this bag. This is more like my weekender. Oh, by the way, Charlie, 
I put bags back up there. I remember your uh, comment that you don't see it. I took down my bags, but I'm starting to put them back up. Like right now, you know, I'm carrying the Bitsy. I really like it. This is great for work, actually. Like this or the other bags are going to be more like my weekenders. For going to work, I'm going to take this. It worked out really well. It was like I felt like I had nothing on, hanging on my body. It was so light. And I had my laptop on my shoulder. So much better than carrying a big purse in my laptop. So, all right, ladies. Well, that's my reveals that were supposed to be an unboxing. So, this really feels nice. This is a real nice bag. This is a really big, if people like big totes. And I don't think I really have too many or any big totes. Do I have any totes? I have the yeah, Adam totes, but not this big. So I'm really happy to get this. And even though it came in the box, it was like folded over like that, but it doesn't have the wrinkle in it. It doesn't have any wrinkles in it. Whenever I fill this up, it will pop that all will pop back out. So I'm very happy with this bag. And I'm happy with this. Like I said, the inside, I wish the lady or would have cleaned it before she uh shipped it out. <laughs> that would have been nice. But um no, well, I thought I got a good deal on this. And I'll be carrying this during the summertime. So hope you ladies like my unboxings or my my reveals. Sorry, it was a really good unboxing too. I was really surprised. But I kept on calling like the bag's the wrong name. Like this is the Chevron, and I was calling it Chelsea through the whole thing. It's like hell getting old, you know. Okay, talk to you ladies later. Love y'all. Oh, I guess I'll do like a what's in my bag or something, maybe with the Chelsea. Uh, look, here I go again. Chevron, Chevron Leisure Shopper. So I could. This will hold everything. Everything. I'll have to find more to put in it. And um, once I get this all cleaned up, I'll be carrying this later, probably sometime um, this month. I'll let this uh, sit for a little while. All right, love you guys. Bye for now.